Hello, thank you for being here guys. This is monthly August 2018, astrology obviously, reading for sign, Sagittarius, for both men and women all over the world born under this sign. Guys, I received many requests, even a can you do monthly astrology reading? I mean, of course I can, you know. So, here we go. Let me try to see through the eyes of astrology in the month of August 2018 what you can expect. So if you have sun in sign of Sag, this is for you. If you have moon in the sign of Sag, this is also for you. If you have stellium or cluster of planets in the sign of Sag, this is also for you. So here we come. Astrology August 2018. So let me start from the very, uh, you know, uh, beginning. Now let me first see where is your ruler and obviously, I mean you already know that, that your ruling planet is Jupiter. Jupiter is in your 12th house in conjunction still with asteroid psyche. Guys, you really need to be, you know, like, you know, tough to understand because God wants you and God, and God I want you um, uh, to, to make sure that basically you understand where you really truly do belong. This is the purpose of Jupiter in your 12th house, where you do belong. Most likely uh, for the past like six months, um, you are more excluded than ever. You think so much about God, you think about religion, you think about spirituality, you talk maybe even with your friends, maybe you even become like a psyche, just a little bit maybe, some of you know. This is you thinking a lot about your past and this is you trying to find your role where you truly do belong. Let me just proceed with a Neptune, which is now in a retrograde motion in your fourth house, but now Neptune is, uh, you know, going back. Whenever you have a planet going in a retrograde motion, it means you need to go inside of you. You need to find an answer inside of you. So whatever now like is bugging you. And while it is in a fourth house, it's basically where, once again, where you do belong. Does my mother or father loves me, you know, how come you have, you know, so many times feeling inside of you that maybe your mother or father likes your brother or sister better than you. You always knew that you have like a very special, you know, purpose of your life, you know. So Jupiter tried to, to align with that feeling, trying to help you to find your life purpose. When Jupiter hit, I mean, when he entered, uh, finally first house which will happen like middle of november then this is like a big you know aha uh -huh moment saying ah so god tried to prepare me for basically your quest okay this is beautiful guys this is really really beautiful so stop accusing you know your parents you know uh if you only loved me like better or more you know i could be like a president of of i don't know the universe, you know, so don't, don't think like that, because your parents, you know, they try to give you, you know, the best, well, nobody's perfect, including your parents, so, you know, stop accusing your parents of whatever, uh, uh, this is, this is maybe not about your parents, maybe not, maybe for some of you, it, yes, but this is like, you know, if only I, I wasn't born in, I don't know, in a jungle or <laughs> whatever, you know, <laughs> what I want to say, like in, in another world, in another uh, state or in another town, blah, 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 I could be so much more uh, like, you know, um, faster growing in any type of, you know, meaning of that word. But believe me, uh, you were born exactly where you needed to be born, including state and town and family and everything else because you need to go through your karmic cycle and that's it when it comes to your finances with a saturn and a pluto and uh, soon by the end of this month mars in the retrograde phase will enter guys what is happening with your money you don't have money right so you know this could be problem with um ir uh, you know this could be you know anything so your money is leaking you know somehow <laughs> your money is obviously is going maybe this is you investing too much of your money in a business but maybe business just not yet gave you this you know money uh, which you invested like you know back so you need to work even more diligently maybe even you need to change the whole perspective you know this is perspective you know jupiter maybe you need 
to change, you know, perspective. Maybe even completely you need to change, you know, your job. Obviously, maybe even you work, you know, something completely wrong. But also, I said, you know, that every single planet, which now is in a retrograde motion, basically saying you, you work too much. You work like a crazy, you know. So maybe this is it. So, you know, I find out, uh, you know, in life, when you mind too much, you are going nowhere. Where you where work too much, you are going nowhere. So basically, this is it, you know. So calm down. Find your sanctuary, Jupiter, in your 12th house. Because a real purpose of your life will be shown to you and soon. So simply, you know, when this... Uh, by the way, you have this North Node in your... Uh, in your ninth house, in conjunction with a with a with a north node, and there is also a Mercury. Mercury now is in a retrograde phase, so you are simply overloaded with informations. And obviously, you want to travel. Maybe you want to start uh, like a job in completely another state, you know, somewhere, you know, in, in the world. And maybe this is you, you know, preparing. So many of your friends are saying you are crazy. Don't do that. But don't listen to your friends. You need to find your passion, Leo. You need to find your passion. And your passion will give you all straight, you know, answers where you need to be. So maybe I can see a fear, at least, you know, for a couple of you. But this compass, this is the most important point, so North Node, you know, saying, yes, you know exactly where you need to do, where you need to be and what you need to do. So when Mercury ain't going to be in a retrograde motion plus period of shadow this this will happen like end of august then this is you saying aha like a big aha moment i knew i knew i knew it you know i knew it i, I was right all uh, along but you know take some you know precaution think clearly make a plan because when sun enters by the end of august in your career section then the end there is a uh, asteroid fortune basically waiting for you only then you will realize every single sacrifice and preparing you know making a plan for your career will uh, will bring you um, a fruit so nothing is in vain something looks maybe in now when when you when you watch when you look at your life it is in vain in vain this is like you know futile blah 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 it is not all i'm saying there is a preparation mode there is like a preparation phase you know so don't think you know like that basically this is you losing uh whatever uh full moon will occur on august uh, 11th this is mark this uh date on your calendar because extremely something important will help uh, you know, uh, around 11th of August, this could be finally real, realizing your plan for your career, but also for so, for so many of you, this is falling in love. And yes, obviously, this person is completely different than any, uh, your previous um, uh, love partner. This could be complete like a stranger, like a foreigner, could be also meeting uh, online, you know, and, you know, and don't share every single private information about you before you really, 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 really get this person like, you know, inside and out. But yes, and so good position for for uh, for, for getting uh, a marriage. But after 25th of August, nothing before because Mercury is in a retrograde uh, shadow period. Okay, uh, what, uh, what else? Uh, okay, uh, Uranus is still, of course, and will stay uh, for the next eight years in your sixth house. Changing, 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 changing values, changing your job, being very curious, you know, changing your diet, changing sport, uh, you know, uh, this type of things, you know. And by all means, you know, your curiosity will help you to find what basically is the best, you know, course of action for you to do. So Uranus ain't gonna leave you alone for the next, you know, eight years. And Uranus is entering into retrograde motion. And this will start on o uh, August 7th. And, you know, this is you being extremely um, unhappy um, with your job. So this Uranus is saying, you know, try, 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 try. At least try. So you ain't gonna regret uh, you know, in a couple of months, obviously, for so many of you, this is changing, you know, your perspective, being so much more clearer and feeling, you know, freer, freer, <laughs> freer, <laughs> much more free inside of you, you know, to, to at least you can try, you know, so Uranus 
you know, a sanctuary. Obviously, you have uh, volcanoes, asteroid, and Juno, you know, commitment. So you want to be committed. Okay, you can be committed, but you know, in your free time, you can start with something else. This could be like, you know, some suppressed talent of some kind, you know. So you can earn money. I don't know, maybe you will become an astrologer, you know, because this is the sign, or at least, you know, people say that that Uranus is the ruler of astrology, but I don't think so. I think the ruler of astrology is a Mercury, you know. Why? Well, because I said so. Because Mercury is a human being watching at the distance at the sky. And guys, this is the sky. This is the sky. And by the way, this is God and knowledge of any kind. Natural law, God, knowledge, Akasha, records and all kind of, you know, things. So, okay, never mind. This is completely another subject. Uh, what else? Uh, in your fifth house, you have asteroid Lucifer. Obviously, you are hurt and deeply, you know, could be uh, from, um, um, uh, could be Leo, could be Taurus, could be an Aries, but especially could be a Pisces, you know, oh, for some of you also could be a Capricorn, you know, so you are hurt, you know, so there is a Chiron in the retrograde motion now asking you, okay, okay, your heart is bleeding, so what? What you have learned from this previous love relationship? Anything, an idea, put your comments down below. This is exactly what Chiron is, you know, trying to teach you. By the way, Ky by the way, Chiron is about, you know, uh, a lesson, uh, about education, you know. And because of this pain inside of you, you will start, you know, maybe with art. Maybe this is you starting writing and maybe even you will become very popular, you know. Okay, whatever. So, nothing basically to be worried about. Everything is normal. There is a reason on every single why there is, you know, an answer to it. So, new moon in a sign of Leo, obviously, beautiful, beautiful chance. And especially if you're like in, in a resort of some kind, somewhere in the world, most likely somewhere in a distance, nine house, very luxury resort. This is where you will find love. For so many of you, another second, this is first marriage and this is basically second marriage, you know. So, and also, and also this could be like a person coming from your past, you know, asking you, are you ready? Are you ready for everything which obviously I'm uh, I, I'm, I'm willing, you know, to give to you? But you will put on the test this person, you know, and this will last at least two, maybe even three months. And only then you will make like, you know, final decision uh, what you want to do. Okay, full moon, August 26th in a sign of Pisces here inside of your house. Finally, you will understand that this pain and the regrets serves no purpose. Could be connected with uh, siblings, could be connected with mother or father. Finally, allowing yourself to understand <clears throat> my life is not the worst one. You know, uh, there is nothing you should basically, you know, complain about. Simply, you know, uh, mind your business on your career and planning. This is planning of your career. So when sun uh, on 23rd of August finally enter like this house, you know, then you will get more money, you will earn more money, you know, and you will understand every single detail, Virgo, every single detail of your career, everything, you know, everything, this process, you know, which is happening obviously in your life, only then you will completely, you know, understand. So lots of courage, lots of planning, understanding there is a, uh, in this chaos of this life, you know, there is an order, you know, like in a court. Order, order when I speak. <laughs> okay, I'm kidding a little bit. Uh, but actually, I'm not kidding, you know. So order, 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 order is needed, you know, to be found. Okay. Uh, did I mention everything? I think I did, more or less. So, 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 so. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. Someone will fall in love with you because all of those, you know, talents, which obviously you do possess, secret love relationship, yep, is possible, very possible. <laughs> Leo, Leo uh, Taurus, um, fellow signs, Sag, uh, even Pisces, maybe even Scorpio, you know. So be very, very wise with, with what type of people you are surrounded with. Because, you know, maybe there is, you know, someone who wants to be in your shoes. Someone who wants to take all of your glory and power uh, away. So, you know, think a little bit about 
that. Yes, Achilles asteroid is in a retrograde motion in conjunction with asteroid Lilith in the second house with all those, you know, planets. Uh, you're not very happy with your money situation, but everything will improve. But before you need to understand where basically you need to be, Jupiter wants to align uh, with your uh, with your with your wider perspective, what you should do, and there is something that you can do for society as well. Maybe uh, what I'm saying now it's not completely clear to you, but you know it will, it will, it will in time. So, honey, you still have a time for everything that basically you want to do on this planet Earth: friendship and job and love and marriage and money and you know every thing else when finally volcanoes you know shift to your seventh house then you will have opportunity even to choose between between two equally good love partners you know but okay this is maybe another story another month okay i really think i mentioned like you know everything guys this is your august monthly reading uh, if you want to donate some money to help me grow my channel, you can do that. There is a link below. Uh, also, you can book a private reading with me. I am pretty fast and precise. Uh, you can you can subscribe on my channel. Thank you. And please do share this video with your friends. Take care. Bye. God bless you all.